Prince William and Kate Middleton are reconciled to the broken relationship with his brother, Prince Harry, it has been claimed. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and other royals celebrated Kate's 40th birthday this weekend. To mark the occasion, Kensington Palace released new photographs taken at Kew Gardens in November last year. The snaps include a dazzling image of Kate in a fiery red dress, as well as two black and white photographs. This weekend also marked a more controversial milestone for the royal family, the departure of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle from the firm. It is now two years since the Duke and Duchess of Sussex announced they were stepping back from their royal roles. In January 2020, the couple outlined their plans to become financially independent while continuing to support the Queen. Following their departure, they settled down in Santa Barbara, California, where they currently live with their two children, Archie and Lilibet. While it has been a tumultuous period for all of those involved, Prince William and Kate are now said to be reconciled to the broken relationship with Harry, according to Andrew Neil, the former veteran BBC journalist and chairman of GB News. The journalist spoke about the events in the recent Channel 5 documentary, 2021, The Queen's Terrible Year. He said, I'm pretty sure from what I've been told that Prince William and Kate are reconciled to the fact that this is broken, and it can't be put together. Not in the foreseeable future anyway, and that they need to go their way and William and Kate will go their way. Harry has returned to the UK from the US and met with William on two separate occasions since leaving. Once was for the funeral of their grandfather, Prince Philip, who passed away aged 99 in April 2021. Meghan did not make the journey as she was heavily pregnant with her and Harry's second child, Lilibet, at the time. The pair met again a few months later, in July, to mark what would have been the 68th birthday of their late mother, Diana, Princess of Wales, unveiling a statue of her at the Sunken Gardens in Kensington Palace. On both occasions, Harry and William were seen deep in conversation. The Queen was said to have been affected by the media analysis of her grandchildren's interactions, according to Stuart Purvis. The former TV executive and documentary producer also spoke for the Channel 5 documentary, and said, it must be galling for the Queen. I don't think you ever quite get used to it when it's so close to you personally. To see your grandsons being cross-examined in the sense of their body language constantly being poured over by the press. This year Harry and William may have another opportunity to meet up as the Queen celebrates her Platinum Jubilee. The historic occasion, which will mark 70 years of Her Majesty's reign, will take place in the UK from June 2 to 5.